Hello kids, I hope all are fine. So today we are going to learn about a new topic. So children, can you imagine a life without house? So can you imagine your life without house and without cooked food by eating raw food? Can you imagine your life without cooking food? And can you imagine your life uh, without mobile, television or any transport facilities? Yes, can you imagine how it will be? Yes. So what would your life have been like? So can you imagine all this? And what would your life have been like? Yes, your life would have been like early humans right yes so today we are going to learn about early humans so early humans they did not any did not had any houses and they did not cook their food they used to have their food without cooking so they did not had any mobile televisions or any cars so Without these, they used to lead their life. So, the people who lived long, long ago did not live like us. So, long, long ago, the early humans, they did not have any facilities like us. Now, we have house to live and now we have mobile phones, televisions and we have many transport facilities now we cook our food and we will eat so but early humans they did not cook their food they used to eat raw food and they did not had any shelters even they did not add any clothes now we wear different kinds of clothes every day right as their life was completely different like us so now shelter so how and where they used to live so early humans did not live in houses so then where they lived so they lived out in the open places so they took shelter under trees and in caves so in the picture you can see here so they early humans they took shelter under trees and in caves so they used to live under big trees and they used to live in caves so because they in early days they don't know how to build their houses and they, and they did not had any cement or bricks to build their houses so they took shelter under trees and in caves so what about clothes what type of clothes they used to wear yes they used leaves or animal skins to cover their bodies this protect them from cold and rain so they used to cover their bodies with leaves so you can see in the picture so they used to cover their bodies with leaves and they used to kill the animals and used animal skin to protect them from cold and rain so they used leaves of trees and animal skin to cover their bodies so what about food so they went from place to place in search of food they ate raw meat wild fruits and roots so nowadays we eat different kinds of food every day right as and we live in one place uh, we will not move from one place to another in search of food but Early humans, they went from one place to another place in search of food. So, they did not live in one place. They went in uh, two other places in search of food. They ate raw meat. They did not cook their food. Because they don't know how to cook the food. Eh? So, 
they used to eat raw meat so they used to eat the raw meat even they did not discovered the fire also the later they discovered fire and the later they know to the uh, uses of fire and they used to eat the wild fruits the fruits what they get in the forest they used to eat that fruits even they used to have different kinds of roots also so to kill the animals they need some tools right how they used to kill the animals let's see so tools so the early humans used tools made out of stones so in the picture you can see so they used these kinds of tools which is made up of stones they used to sharp the stones and they used to put a stick to this stone and they killed wild animals with this sharp stones so the early humans used tools which is made out of stones so later they know to use the fire so discovery of fire so the early humans learned how to make fire by rubbing two stones together so later these early humans know to how to make fires they rubbed two stones to make fire so when you rub the two stones with so when you rub two stones you will get a fire right is so early humans learned how to make a fire by rubbing two stones so this fire helped them in many ways so they were now able to cook the meat of animals so in the picture you can see they used this fire to cook their food so now before they were not using this fire and they used to eat the flesh of animals without cooking after introductions of after discovery of fire they used to cook the meat of animals so fire also kept them warm and protect them from wild animals so not only they used the fire to cook food so this fire helped them to keep away the wild and dangerous animals so when the wild and dangerous animals come near to them they used to show the fire to the wild animals so by seeing the fires this wild animals used to run away from them so fire helped them in many ways this fire helped them during the cold weather so fire helped them to protect them from cold weather so this is about the early humans so after watching the video after reading the textbook you should start doing the exercise activities so you should color this picture so you should color this picture of a dinosaur and you should try to draw this picture in other sheet of paper you, so you this picture you can draw in your scrapbook so do it on your own okay so have a great day thank you